Hi there, it's Jason Chi, sales representative with the Price Real Estate team at Keller Williams Lifestyles Realty right here in London. And we're gonna give you our quick market update for the fall of 2020. Uh, actually, we'll be talking a little bit about the summer. Uh, basically, all I have to say is the last few months have been super busy. Sales, listings. It may not look like listings have been happening an awful lot, but they have. Um, the overall sales number for the year, um, we're doing really, really well. Uh, I think we're sitting around fourth or fifth all time. Um, and we'd have a lot more than that if we had uh, the listings to support it, but we're not in a significant hole as far as average number of listings that we have this time of year or th to this point of the year. Things are pretty much on pace, just that we aren't catching up anywhere just because the buys are eating up all of the newly listed homes. Uh, some of that, there's a few reasons for. Um, one being, we still are seeing people migrate out of Toronto to the London area. London is growing. What you're going to see is people who potentially were working in Toronto, but living in London, giving up those Toronto locations. They could be rentals, uh, they could be owned condos. And what they're doing is they're amalgamating their money in London and they're purchasing maybe a larger home in London because they haven't had to be commuting to Toronto with the remote work being able to uh, happen during COVID. And I think that's what we're gonna see. We're gonna see a lot of companies that had people working in Toronto, they're not gonna be bringing people in nearly as much and we're gonna see a lot more working at home, which means if you've got a home office in your house, that's probably be going to be a big selling feature over the next little while. Uh, just like pools, people won't be traveling much. So pools are a hot commodity in homes. Something else you might've noticed in the market is the increase in development or what looks like an increase in development, just cause we're not out and about as much. Maybe you drove into an area where you didn't know, you may have noticed some development happening and then the next time you go in, all of a sudden there's a building there or a bunch of houses that weren't there before. It, it didn't dawn on me until recently when I was driving around with the kids and they're the ones who noticed it because they don't get to go out with us everywhere when we go out now. So it's pretty much been hang out at the house and go to school and now that maybe they're in the car while we go out and do something, we have hockey practices happening, things like that. That's where it was brought to my attention because they're the ones pointing out things that I'm like, oh yeah, I guess that wasn't out the la or it wasn't there the last time we drove by. So it's kind of neat to see. Yes, London is still growing and yes, we are going to see the numbers continue to go up. Uh, something I wanna bring up, October itself, we had the best sales number of all time in October. Uh, we had 917 homes sold and listings. We listed quite a few homes out there, even though we don't have a lot on the market. The listing count is keeping up with the sales count pretty much, although we could always use more listings. Um, so if you happen to have one of those homes, maybe with a home office uh, and, a, and or a pool, and you've been contemplating a downsize or something like that, definitely uh, keep it in mind and potentially reach out to us because it the, the time is definitely now for a lot of people looking for these things. If you've got questions about the market and you wanna reach out to us, you can do so at 519-663-9411 or shoot us an email, info at pricerealestateteam.com.